All right, here we go. Pokemon Legends Arceus. I did not see any spoilers to this. Or trailers. Only one trailer. Long time ago. Game Freak. We love you, buddy. Here we go. In a world. I'm kidding. Welcome to my realm, located beyond time and space. Okay. It is well that thou art here. Ooh. I am that which humans call Arceus. Now, I wish to know thine appearance. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is really good. And once again, they can't give me long hair. What is thy name? I love this. I feel like I'm in Shakespeare or something. Yeah, that's me. Looks nothing like me. Johnny. Soon thou shalt find thyself in a world strange to thee. A world inhabited by wondrous creatures that humans call Pokemon. I'm so excited I can barely read, <laughs> to be honest. Johnny, seek out all Pokemon and thou shalt find me once more. Ooh, okay. Okay, buddy. Okay, Arceus. That was not a message from Professor Oak, or from a professor this time. From a god! Yo. Yo. Okay. Legit does not feel like a Pokemon game. There's my cell phone. Some sparkles. Johnny Sparkles. That's right there. Whoa, buddy! Music is really nice, too. Just don't tell me he gives me a cell phone, man. What is this? We're going into a baby formation? Yo, I don't know what just happened. That does not exp explain anything. But I don't think it matters. I think they want us to be confused. Wake up! Oh! Do wake up, won't you? That's probably mom. That's probably mom. It is not mom at all! Whoa! Who is this? Are you alive, my boy? I hope... It, was that a guy voice or...? Yeah, whatever. That voice fits. Yo, legit, this is what Sword and Shield was supposed to look like. For sure. We have real trees this time. You gave me quite the shock falling from the sky. Ooh, we fell from the sky? But thank goodness you seem unharmed. What? Who are you? I guess where am I is a better question. Why? This is Prelude Beach, of course. Dear me, did the shock of your fall somehow add all your memory? I must say, your clothing is unusual. You wouldn't happen to have an acquaintance in these parts, would you? I doubt it. You never know. Why are we so sad? I see, you seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Might I offer some directions? Do you have somewhere around here you could stay? So you don't know anyone here. Oh, sorry, the voice. And you don't know even know where to spend the night. Well, this is proper pickle indeed. Are you quite sure you'll be able to survive? Uh, yeah, somehow, I guess. I made it this far. I mean, I was literally talking to a god. I'm sure I can. And I withstood a fall from the sky. Oh my, I'd completely forgotten. I had just cut off with these three runaway Pokemon when you stumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if they knew you appear here. Well, I can't speak at all. This is great. Ah, uh, but do you even know what a Pokemon is? Y yeah, dude. Yeah. Yeah, dude. We have those in our land. Oh, I do, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Lavington. I am something of a Pokemon professor. There it is. This is to say I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon such as these three. What? Oh, blast and bother. My darling Pokemon. Why must you run away from me again? I'm terribly sorry, but do you think you could help me round them up? I beg you. Sounds like we're rounding up chickens. Imagine that's what it's gonna be like. Rounding up chickens like from those Zelda games. Okay, here we go. First time moving. Can you move your camera? Yeah, you can definitely move your camera. So the target where I have to go is kind of, um, it has the Arceus vibe to it. 
so it, it looks pretty nice. Okay, this is walking. Can you run? Yeah, you could. You can run. Wow. I guess we'll go, we'll go straight to the point. Right after I look at this barrel. Can you jump? Tell me you can jump. Tell me you can jump. Is this another Pokemon game where you can't jump? No <laughs> way. Did they legit make another game? Open world, but you can't jump. You can just crouch. What is this? It was a cell phone. Dude. There's a glowing beeping object over there. Let's go. There's anime that a god... Uh, I was watching it the other day. An anime that a god gives you cell phones. Very different story. Tragic. You found something that resembles a phone. It's probably your phone, <laughs> but it's changed shape. A message appeared on the screen. I bestow upon this Ark phone and thy mission seek out all Pokemon. I, yo, this guy, Ark is having a blast right now. This is a game to him. Seek out all Pokemon. So... I can't believe we can't jump. You you gotta be kidding me, man. We can run without shoes. That's cool. Okay, we can run over things. Can you climb a tree? Can't climb a tree. Can you climb a tree? No, you can't climb a tree. <laughs> That'd be cool though. The graphics are like a better sword and shield. That's kind of what it is. I tried catching my little runaways by tossing some Pokeballs their way, but I'm not in the best all sort of thing. You see? We get it. I'd love you to give it a go. Perhaps I should tell you a bit about these three first. All right. Now that one is Rowlet. For those who don't know Pokemon, which could be many of you. Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant. Ooh. And apparently it battles using its sharp feathers. Crew. <laughs> That's definitely not the sound. Cyndaquil. That's like Gen 2 right there. That one over there is Cyndaquil. The fire burning on Cyndaquil's back will flare up whenever it's surprised or irate. Boom. Oshawat. That Pokemon near the pond is Oshawat. Oshawat naps while floating on the water, and it can battle using the shell-like object on his belly. Asha, what are you talking about? Plish splash. Sure. Oh my, I nearly forgot to cover the most crucial thing. How to go through... We, we kind of know this one. Ooh, maybe we don't. Different Pokeball. Here you are, my boy. Pokeballs. Throw these at the Pokemon and catch them. You obtained 50. Yo, dude. A mysterious ball that can be thrown at wild Pokemon in order to catch them. These balls can be crafted and... Ooh, we can craft them. What's so strange about them, you ask? Well, each and every Pokemon is able to shrink itself down to a minuscule size. And that's where Pokeballs come in. We are not going to explain the process. Pokeballs are a recent invention, you see. Yeah. Why? The Pokemon will shrink down and fit inside the ball. Comfy as can be. Hold down the R button to ready a Pokeball and take aim. Okay. So... Wait, I oh, I have to choose which Pokemon I want. So, uh, just, just a heads up here, guys. I believe they actually all have different final forms. You can't use Gyro right now to, to help catch. They all have final, f different final forms, regional forms. I don't know what they are. I didn't check, but I, I heard that they do. Where's the other boy? Okay, Cyndaquil. We're going to go for... Um... Yo, let's go for Cyndaquil. It's been so long we saw Cyndaquil. Let's go for Cyndaquil. Hey, yeah. Uh, can I walk close there? Oh, nice. Magically comes to me. Wonderful, you've caught a Pokemon. It seems you've quite the knack for this Pokemon catching business, Johnny. Jolly useful skill to have around here. Only two of my darling runaways. Oh, we just catch them all. Can we throw from across? Okay, how far can we throw? Come on. Because that will go. Yeah, that doesn't work. Either. Maybe we can get a better throw in the game. That'd be really, really interesting. Oh, they move. Interesting. Okay, okay nice. Yeah, maybe you can get like a stronger throw or something. The character gets like jacked. Many people fear even approach Pokemon. Bravo indeed. Just one more to go. Let's go. Who would have you chosen? Not knowing the final... Oh! He popped out of the ball! Yes, I'm afraid that can happen. Pokeballs are hardly 100% foolproof. Give it another go, old boy. Sure. Where are you, buddy? In the water. What are you talking about, Ashawad? Thank you very much indeed. Oh, what a relief to have them all back. You see, Pokeballs have just only been invented, and not many have mastered the skill of using them. 
So, okay. Enter you, a person with a clear talent for catching Pokemon. Our goal is to seek out every Pokemon, and mine is to have all those Pokemon caught. Whoa. Come on, what do you say? Shall we help one another out, my boy? Uh, yeah, you convince me. I feel like this guy's the villain. Look at that smile. Look at those eyes. Like Brock's long lost relative. First things first, get these Pokemon back to the village. Lots of dialogue. They really want to get you soaked in. Which I guess makes sense. Oh, that my character's just like staring. Oh no, not staring at me. You're looking at the volcano. I'm curious to why they didn't choose to make it look a bit more like Breath of the Wild like. Because you know they can. You know they have the resources. I mean, it still looks good. This looks pretty cool. It does have Sword and Shield vibes, though. Very beautiful. My character looks so scared. What a beautiful town. What a wonderful village. Nice. This is... This way, if you please. Okay, Jubilee's village is long... Oh, text while walking. Interesting. Look at that guy over there. Not quite there is a... <laughs> oh, yeah, they're talking about my outfit. Oh, no, you're, you're going to have to uh, stop hunching there, buddy. What manner of dress is that? <laughs> oh, she's quiet. It'll hear you. Oh, I'm just sweeping the floor. I never really understood. Well, I guess it was a mess. We're not supposed to talk strangers, you know. Who's that with the professor? I was just sweeping the floor outside, sweeping outside like a good Samaritan. Oh, bother a nation. Botheration. What'd you forget, buddy? I need to go back and report and successfully discovered the escape Pokemon. Might I ask you to wait for me at the canteen? The canteen! It's very Italian to have that. Your arc phone is beeping. Somehow it seems to show you where you need to go next. Let's go. Is that a green chin strap? Well, now. Aren't you awfully suspicious? Yes, everyone has the same voice. I can only do two voices. Three. You'll see the third when it comes. We don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Galaxy. Oh, we're so sad. You look way cooler than me. Who are you? That's my third voice. I've never seen anyone dressed like you are. Everyone's southern here. What if we were attacked by a Pokemon? You'd be minced meat at those flimsy clothes. You must have ties with somebody else in the village. Sure. Perhaps we've met the Professor Laventon. His Pokemon do not get away from him at times. It do get away. Makes me a bit worried for him. I suppose I'm hardly one to talk. I've had some uh, trouble with Pokemon myself. I was hit by a Pokemon move called Thunder Shock not long ago and had to take to my bed. But the professor, well, I do wonder how long he'll last. Unfortunately, it's just as Akari says. That's a cool name. I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. Akari. Professor! Professor! But everything will be quite all right now. Johnny here has agreed to help us with the Pokedex. Wow, look how angry she was. Did you see that look? That death stare she just gave me? Excuse me? You can't just slap a badge on whoever you like without Captain Silene's permission. I'll allow it. Oh. Captain Silene. She's got like a uh, Vi vibes. I'm the captain of the Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Silene. I hope I'm saying that right. Usually say things wrong. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you've got plenty of questions for our visitor. That's quite all right. I prefer to eat alone. Ooh, I might appreciate meals without distraction. Look at their looks. I love the, that they're actually putting so much effort into their facial expressions. Aloof as always, I see. Well, no matter. The rest of us can share a meal and some pleasant conversation. Then, hey, hey, Canadian like me. Benny, old chum! The usual potato mochi, if you please. But uh, make it for three today. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Professor Lavendon, where exactly did you meet our visitor here? Oh, well, you know that great hole in the sky? The one people call Space Time Rift? Ah, our new friend fell right out of it. You can't be serious. Facial expressions on point. Good job, Game Freak Pokemon Company. Impressive. 
Come on now, I'm a scientist. My job is to observe and explain an any and all phenomena. Phenomena. Do, 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 do. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. But that's where Johnny will come in. That's me. He successfully caught three Pokemon. Three of them quick in order, you understand? Nobody in the galaxy team is capable of a feat such like that. Cling. Three. We have a hard enough, uh, hard enough time catching even one when wild Pokemon come after us. That was quite delicious. Quite delicious indeed. Johnny was it for tonight. At least we'll provide you a place to sleep. It's a long, long intro. Very nice place. But if you fail to pass the trial, you will be expelled from the village to meet your fate. And perhaps your death in the wilds. A rift in the sky, people falling from it. The world is full of mysteries. Yeah, imagine we just see a rift in the sky. All right. We are finally seeing what's going on in this game. Oh, so many. Whoa! Whoa, the vibration on my controller, dude. That was wild. Johnny absolutely must pass this trial. And as a professor of Pokemon, I've got just the ticket to help you accomplish that. Now we got to choose our Pokemon. I don't know who to choose, man. I'm kind of vibing with Cyndaquil, but I don't know what their final forms look like. Pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy for your first partner. All right. All from different generations. Why don't you just give me total dial? All right. Which should I choose? Comment down below. No, I won't see that in time. Look at them. Look at me. We're going, we're going, we're going for Oshawott. We're just going to take Oshawott. I think that's what's going to go on here. No, I don't know if I want it. Oh, man, this is tough. No, not Oshawott. We're not going for Oshawott. We're going for Sin... We're going for Cyndaquil. We're going for Cyndaquil. I've never chosen Cyndaquil before, so we're going to go for Cyndaquil. I've chosen the other two before, and that's what we're going to do. Oh, he's so cute. Baby Cyndaquil so nice. You look funny. With my steampunk Pokeball, you received Cyndaquil. Let's go. Let's go. We're finally venturing on our own. Turn left. Go through the gate. Look at our Pokeballs. Can I switch them? Switch to Cyndaquil? Wait. That's throwing Cyndaquil? And that's throwing a Pokeball. Well, you look quite the character. You look like you came from Hyrule. How about you and I see how our Pokemon stand up and... Sure, let's battle. Let's battle, dude. Our first battle. Look at that crooked smile. You and your Togepi. I got a Cyndaquil. Go Cyndaquil! Battle! Wait, what? Oh, no way! Nice! Alright, so this is our first time jumping into battle. Fight! Quick attack? Cyndaquil, you take a attack. So, so I can move around for some reason? I wonder if there's a purpose for me moving around. You have to stop moving when you make your Pokemon attack. This is interesting. This is something I have never experienced before. It kind of reminds me of uh, Nino Kuni. Have you guys uh, played that game? That kind of the vibe I'm getting right now. So I wonder if we can also help the battle. Moves, items, use them well. Yeah, we only had one move. All right, so we just magically fast forwarded because that was over an hour's worth of tutorial. Uh, we're gonna jump in straight to the gameplay here and see exactly what this is all about. I'll let you know what I figured out and uh, you'll, you'll basically see where this is going. Our job right now is to complete tasks of the Pokedex. In our black and white Pokedex here, each there's a bunch of Pokemon we got and it's actually really cool. Each Pokemon has some research tasks and we need to complete them. Sometimes you gotta catch like 15 of a certain Pokemon. Can we climb this? Okay, there, there's potential of climbing. What is this? Maybe throw our Pokeball at it? Uh, throw a Pokemon at it. Booyah! Dude, Tumblestone. All right, that's just some Tumblestone. Supposedly you can make your own Pokeballs by crafting as well. As we are searching just to complete the Pokedex. So we can switch to our Pokeballs here. 
throw that on the doof and start catching. Interesting. And now we know we can collect more of these boys. Tumble stone, which uh, is used to make pokeballs. And let's 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 gather those pokeballs. That's me, Johnny. All right, we we'll get into our items. We can go into our craft. Craft. Click this pokeball, and we can craft some pokeballs. We're crouching to be more stealthy. You know, I really want it to be that while you're trying to be stealthy, it would have that little you know, gauge of how stealthy you are like it is in Breath of the Wild. Hey, buddy! Let's go! That's right! Let's go catch some fancy Pokemon here. Leaks falling off the ground. Let's go fight a battle. Whoa! Whoa, 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 okay, okay, whoa, whoa. Yo, that thing is huge! Yo. We can throw our Pokeball- Oh, that was- that was a horrible idea. <laughs> Who are we throwing out versus this? Starly? Go, go, go! Battle! Battle, Starly! Yo, what? I don't know what's going on. Okay, nice, nice. We, we got into a battle. It's- Yo, I didn't know Ponyta was that huge. This, that's crazy. Hypnosis. Nice. So, you you can move. This is super cool. Moving through battle. Gust. Let's go, let's go. What level is that? It's level 40?! Agile stuff. Yo, forget it. We're out of here. We're out of here. Yo, I just fought, I just fought a level. I'm fighting a level 40. A 40 Ponyta. All right, so th that's kind of cool. Let's let's just uh, let's ca let's throw a Pokeball at it and see if that works. I really doubt this is gonna work, but let's see what happens. No way. Oh yeah, I didn't think that was gonna happen. I'm not gonna waste my time here. We're gonna run. We're gonna run. Fire blast. I'm sorry, Badoof. Badoof avoided the attack! What? Wait, what? Yo. Yo, it's not it's not turn-based. Also, Badoof is God. But uh Rapidus just used two attacks at the same time. Yeah, we're we're running from that, dude. You can dodge. You 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 could dodge. This is rough. Whoa, yo! The Pokemon legit- The- Okay, you, What? Okay, whoa! I, I'm lost for words right now, I'm sorry. The- The- The Pokemon- Can legit- Dude! No way. Well, that's what happens. That's- That's the cutscene of when, uh... When you die. Oh, you drop stuff when you faint too! Okay, this just, you know, this just got really interesting. We come back to our stuff. Okay. So this is our base. That's a professor. We got some research tasks to do. Let's, uh, let's do one of them. I, I think you can just, like, go along, go through your day, catch po- Yeah, this, this doesn't feel healthy. No way! I'm just, I'm just collecting Pokemon everywhere. Oh my god. I tried to climb a tree. You cannot climb a tree. There's some uh, some stuff here. We're gonna throw a birdie at this tree. Knocks down some apricorns. That's a really cool way. Another thing I thought was awesome about this game. You know how you can never just walk over. Just doesn't let you go through in Sword and Shield. Check this out. Oh, can we roll? Oh, buddy, we have acrobatics now. For, like we don't have a jump, but we have a roll. And that is something I've never seen in a Pokemon game. What a beauty. What a lovely game. This thing right there. Look at that. It's coming out of the ground. What are you doing coming out of the ground? Oh, didn't want to do that. What are you doing coming out of the ground, buddy? Come on. Come on. It's not that difficult, dude. It's not that difficult, human. Come on. Yes, we did it. We climbed. Let's see what that shaking thing is all about. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna do this very slow. It's important to note that this could be dangerous. Let's switch both one. Here we go. Hey, dude! It's a dear dude, dude. I love you, bro. Jill to the dude. I'm catching that. 
all my might. Nice. He was tackly. I just realized in the background, those are, uh, those are onyxes. Check this out. Uh, okay, I thought it was onyx. Maybe it's not onyx. It's so crazy that you're just running around. Ooh, that's a shaking tree. Ladies and gentlemen, that tree is shaking. It's either cold, windy, or my thoughts. We're gonna make a new friend. Wait. Whoa. What is that? Burmy! Burmy, buddy! Burms, how's it going? We're gonna get to that tree by jumping off the cliff! Oh, wow, that felt good. That felt good. Let's get over there. I'm pretty sure we can't just jump off the cliff because there's fall damage. So I guess we'll have to slowly go down. Whoa. Yo, that is a huge parasect. Can we fight it? Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, there's a huge parasect right there. Oh, he's mad. Can we, like, throw a ball at him? Oh! It actually tried? No way. That was a horrible idea. Why did I do that? I should have used a heavy ball. Should definitely use the heavy ball. Let's get out of there. Let's get out of there. Let's get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. No! No! Run! Is it chasing me? Yeah, it's chasing me. Yo, that's a huge parasect. When the grass. What if we just like? No. Whoa! Okay. No, no. No. That didn't work. That didn't work. Okay. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Run. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Oh, look. That's a little. Let me. Let me steal your babies on the way. Gonna take some babies on the way as we go. What? I'm taking your minions! That is a berry! I wanted to throw a Pokeball! I am throwing! I can't catch anything! It's not letting me catch it! Okay, we're leaving. We're leaving. I'm sorry. We're leaving. I'm sorry to bother you. Gosh. Man. I just wanted your kids. Let's head to our next destination. Making Pokeballs rolling around and the speed of sound. Got places to go, got to follow my rainbow. Oh, I'm sorry, Birdie. I'm not going to really bother you. I kind of want to jump off this cliff. If you subscribe now, I will jump off this cliff. But we can't swim. Did you see that big bird in the sky? Wow. I did my, my fair part of the bargain. Just looking for Bidoofs, guys. Just grabbing your egg. Just grabbing your egg. Hey, Joe dudes. I get it. Oh, you're blocking this? I'll take that. Wow, what a far shot. That was impressive. That was really impressive. I should have done it from up here. Just Bidoofing around. As you can see in this wild country, there's a Bidoof not too far from a human. And everybody knows you cannot get too close to a Bidoof, or else you yourself will be Bidoofed. Hey, this pony test. What is that? Also not. Whoa, whoa, ho, 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 ho! I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. A Jew dude on the right of me. He wants to slam right into me. I believe in the quill. You can do what you will. You can do what you will. All right, you did. You did. Did. Listen, did. Listen. I'm gonna climb up this mountain, and I'm gonna send my syndical after you if you don't uh, let me alone. It does not sound like you're leaving me alone, so uh, I'm gonna do what I said I was gonna do. Well, first we'll start by getting this, because this is important. Nice! Actually makes you feel like a Pokemon trainer. And then, we're gonna do this. 
Okay, okay, go ahead. Go, get all the way down there. Check this out. Huh! Oh, let's see if this works. Huh! No? Huh! Come on. Come on. There it is. There it is, so it actually does work. And we can stand all the way down here, so we don't get hit by the battle. We can stand this far, because we know that we could actually get hit. Wait, if I stand... If I stand right here, will I get hit? Oh, I even get hit- no, I fall from my own. But what did you do? Yo- Wait, uh, what am I talking about? That's not my health, that was Cyndaquil's health. If- you actually get damaged if, if you go into the middle. So- so that's uh, that, that's a thing, guys. If we throw this boy... Oh yeah, and he grabs the item for us! Oh... Would you look at that specimen? Some have spoken things about this Pokemon that you do not want to hear. We will try to avoid its vision. And we will try to throw a Pokeball at its back. If we stay very quiet, we will throw it at its bosom. Here we are. Shoot. And that was, that was pretty good. We did not catch the specimen, and it is very, very angry at us. So we must run. Roar! Here we go. All of my Pokemon are fainted. Because that, uh, that bunny over there kicked my butt. And I'm still alive. That's crazy. Never in a Pokemon game does that happen. They always sent you to Pokemon Center. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe to this channel right here. Thank you, Mojo Plays, for having me. I'm Johnny Sparkles from the Sparkle Squad. Peace out. This game rocks. I definitely want to keep playing it more. Here, here. Come on. Wow. You heard it straight from Cyndaquil, folks. Peace. Check out this other recent clip from Mojo Plays, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.